If you like this video and channel, click on the like button and subscribe button. Also, if you want to have notification when new video released, click on the notified button. Welcome in video where we show how to change language in your HMI project and in your HMI runtime and also how to add some languages into your project. In this example, we work with comfort panel. First, we create some new screen. Okay, we defined a start screen and insert to the screen some object, for example, alarm view. Then we insert some buttons. text file and rectangle. We create some environment of the screen to, the, to, to show how language changing when we define new languages. Okay, for example, we insert text wealth change the font of this text for example to 30 acknowledgements this text insert here for example button open and button close <coughs> and one button for changing the language with name change language okay now we have only some template for our example here you have only english because we define project language as english Okay, when we want to insert some new languages, you go to the project tree in TIA portal and open the option languages and resources and click on the project languages. Here you can insert all languages which you have in TIA portal. For example, we insert German language and I don't know, Spanish. Okay, save the project. But at first, you also want to enable these languages in your HMI. You open the HMI project, click on the runtime settings, and click on, click on the option language and font. Here you have all project languages. <clears throat> and if you want to enable these languages in your HMI, you just click on the enable radio button enable checkbox okay now we enable german and spanish language in your hmi here you can define the fonts of these languages configure at font one configure at font two define default font atc okay save the project go back to the example screen and here when you want to change runtime language for example for this we use this button change language go to the events of this button for example we use press event and we use function set language where we after pressing this button we change the language of the HMI runtime for example now we use toggle if we press first time we change from English to German if we press second time we change the language from German to Spanish and when we again <clears throat> click on this button we change the language from Spanish to English okay for example for this text we define the languages you click on the text file and on the text option 
and here you can see you can define the translation of the <coughs> valve wow text in German is Ventil and in Spanish is Valva. Okay. Now we can save it and try the runtime and see if we can change the language. Okay. Okay, now reference language is English. This is this means when we start the runtime we have the English on the screen. When we click on the change language, we change it to the German. Okay, as you can see Wentil. Under the text, uh, we don't define the translation of the text of the button open, close, and change language. This is why we have here only text. When we click second time on the change language button, we see the Spanish translation. And when we click again, we see again English translation. Okay, now you can see system text as uh, the text of the RM view object is, is translated automatically. We can see now is German language and now is Spanish. Okay. Also, you can translate the text of your HMI, <clears throat> for example, by clicking on the HMI project, go to the tools and click on the project text. Here you can select on which device you can you want to see the text for us is HMI one. OK, and here you can see all texts in your HMI project. For example, we change here text close in <clears throat> in German is I, I translate this text in Google Translator is schrieben and in Spanish is this one paste, save the project, rebuild the project. After some changes, it's good to rebuild your project. It's something like compiling. OK, compiling finished. And now we can go to the runtime and check if close changing is text. OK. English close, German, yes, it's right. And also in Spanish language, we have a translation. The third way how to using, how to translate your text in your HMI is export the old text, for example, to Excel file make a translation in this Excel file and then import back this Excel file. How you can do this, for example, you click on the HMI project, go to the tools, and here you have export project text. Okay, source language will be English, target language, for example, for now is German. Here you can select which text you want to export. And this is the name of the export file and patch. OK, export it. Export complex, complete successfully. OK, go to the patch. And here you can see the exported file. We click on it. And here you have all texts of your HMI. This is the source text and this is the text for the translation. This is some object which you want to translate and the patch to this object is here. 
it's good to don't change this this text only your text as English and German for now okay for example we here we have here we have here English and Deutsch German sorry German okay close we have translate change language we translate as this one then we translate this one open then we translate valves we have translated okay this is all for now what what we translate now we go back to the tia portal and import the translations okay here you add the patch what you what you want to translate we go to the to the our project language and here is our full file okay import source language okay import imports completed successfully okay save rebuild the project okay save and now we go to the runtime check if we translate the languages yes how we can see we translate all translations are in the runtime often schlieben but we still we don't have the spain translation now we go back to the project and make same for exporting the file okay source language will be still english but target language we changed to spanish export overwrite okay go back to the folder open the excel file but now we have only english and spanish again we open the our world file and we can make the translation change language is this one Sorry. Open is this one. And also we want to Try so okay close mark we have close open we have wealth we have <clears throat> a change language we also have okay save this don't save okay we go back to the TIA portal and now we can again import Excel file Okay, save the project, rebuild project. And now we can go again check the runtime if translation is successful. Yes, and now we can see this is the English language, this is the German language and this is the Spanish. Okay, this is only toggle event, but also you can use <clears throat> uh, 
for example on other buttons we have this button and we want to do this if we click on this button we change the language to English and if we click on the another button we change the language to Spanish to German and next this button will be for the Spanish okay we go to the properties of this button and for example we use graphic and from the graphic folders we use for first button United, United States flag for second button will be Germany flag Oop. and for third button will be Spain flag Okay, change the appearance of these buttons and now we want to use events and also we use function set language but for this button we want to set language for English we go back to the HMI project 3 click on the runtime settings and check the numbers for languages, languages, uh, we can see English have number zero, German have number one, and Spanish have number two. Okay, we go back to the screen, and if we click on the United States flag, we change the language to number zero. You can see zero, zero. When we click on the German flag, we change the language to number one because number one is in our project German language and when we click on the Spain flag we change the language to number two okay and now we can try it in runtime <coughs> Okay, now, as you can see, when we click on the flag of United States, we change the language of runtime to English. When we click on the German flag, we change the language on the German. And when we click on the Spain flag, we change the language to the Spanish. Okay, this is all for this video where you see how to change and add the languages into your HMI project. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.